Hey everybody, we're about to get started. We decided to go ahead and replace the tile in this bathroom. So, but first, clearly, we got to clear out the old tile first, and this is a first time for us. So, I've read a few things on the internet. We're going to start off with the hammer and chisel and give that a shot, and then we'll go from there and see how it goes. So, uh, wish us luck, and uh, here goes. And you can substitute sunglasses for safety goggles. Yes, these are just as good as coasters, are just as good as safety goggles. All right, here we go. It just stopped it. No, it didn't. <laughs> there's concrete under there somewhere. Evidently, there's two types of uh, flooring uh, way that they put down the ceramic tile. There's, We're uh, going to need a broom. Yeah, we are. There's, there's two types. I don't know which is okay. which. Um, but I think we've got the kind that's newer, it's called Thin Set, and uh, it's usually better, but it's hard to get up. So I think that's what we've got, and I'm probably going to get a jackhammer in a minute, but I'm going to go at this for about 10 or 15 minutes, and we'll see. So, check back with you later. <laughs> Alright, so I thought I'd better go ahead and film a little bit more. As you can see, it's kind of coming up pretty good. I'm actually a little bit surprised. Um, but some of them have been coming out in a uh, whole tile, so I thought I would film a little bit more. Um, before we got done, this probably took me about 15 minutes, so I thought, well, I'll go ahead and film a little bit more real quick. So, again, just getting, putting the safety goggles on. Yes, Shauna. Um, just getting down at the very base of it and just kind of going to town on it. So, you can see it's not too bad. Um, I know we've got a little bit of uh, skin set down here. We'll talk about that in a little bit, but uh, I'll just keep at it and I'll post up a little bit more later. So as you can see, we just got done uh, getting up all the tile. I broke it all up, probably took me a little over an hour um, between that and taking up the, the toilet and hauling it out and everything. I've swept it all up. Now the last thing I've got to do is um, I'm going to use my DeWalt vacuum here um, with its HEPA filter, which is stinking awesome, to go ahead and vacuum up the rest of the stuff to try to keep it out of the house. Um, and then later on we'll, we'll come back and try to break up the rest of this little bit of a quick set. So I'm going to get busy doing this and we'll be back in a little bit. So um, I got a scraper and it's time to get this uh, thin set up. As you can see, there's just a thin layer over the concrete. I uh, went ahead and got this scraper that goes on my DeWalt uh, reciprocating saw. And uh, I think it's going to work really, really well. I'll go ahead and get, show you a little bit of that. So you can see that it gets it off pretty good and probably see this little cloud of smoke um, which is why you're supposed to have a really nice respirator or mask that I kind of forgot to get. But anyway, um, it seems to be really easy. I'm going to just kind of go ahead and hit all of this and then at the end we'll clean it up and uh, vacuum it up again with our uh, shop vac. So I'm going to get going on this. So I'm about halfway through I guess um, doing the floor. I've used the, uh, trying out tons of method for everyone. We've used the DeWalt reciprocating saw, 
with the uh, spouter bit attachment uh, that's made for scraping and it's going pretty good uh, gotten up the first half or so mostly with that um, the I've also right now run out of battery so I'm waiting for those to charge a little bit and I've got this cheap uh, scraper that I got before it's just a normal floor scraper and um, it's not too bad it works a little bit better when you use a little bit of a hammer and you don't hit your hand 